What's up, I'm at the archery range and we're gonna test out some finger tabs. A little review. We got this leather hide and drink finger tab. Tried a few shots with it and it's pretty nice. Then we have this bare archery finger tab. It was a little big when I got it so I had to cut it down to size. I need to retrieve my arrows. Show you what we're working with target wise. We got this big hay bale here and the smaller hay bale. Some of these hay bales are so busted that the arrows go all the way through it or pretty close and it really messes up the fletching. I think most of the fletchings that are messed up on my arrows are from this archery range, but whatever. We got the HS strut, turkey target. I love it, I love turkeys. And we got the Easton Carbon Legacy arrows. Let's talk about the hide and drink tab. It's got this cool owl on it. It's uh, held on your finger with this little thing here really no way to tighten it to keep it tight on your hand so you have to readjust it feels good with the fingers pretty comfortable it gives you a lot of space when you're holding the string what's nice is that it's leather both of the pieces here feels pretty good when you're pulling that string let's talk about the bear archery it's got this cool red stitching it goes on your finger here you kind of keep it in place like that once you kind of get it like formed a little and you break it in more, it's not so bad to get a handle on, but it's easier to get a grip on this because it's leather. The back piece on the bare archery tab is just this cheap felt material, so it's a little trickier once it's loose to kind of get it. And because I cut it too small, kind of flimsy. Honestly, I'd say this one is a lot better. I think I paid like $14 for this, and the bare archery tab couldn't have been more than 10 to 15 bucks, but this is definitely better quality leather, so. We're going to start with the bare archery finger tab. You just really feel that string like flop. I don't know, something about this is just not, not that comfortable. Finger tabs took me a while to get used to and I'm still not totally used to it. Probably one of the better groupings I've had shooting with this, besides that first arrow. If this would be a little tighter on the hand, and I probably could get it tighter on the hand, it would be the perfect finger tab that I've tried so far. Similar results shot wise using this finger tab versus bear. Honestly, I shot better with the bear finger tab, but this one's just more comfortable. Yeah, I gotta do something about this guy being so flappy, and then it's a real winner. I think that's all I got for now. I'll let you guys decide what you think is better. Looseness, but more comfort, versus discomfort, but more precision. I'd say precision is a little more important, but if I can fix this guy, it'll be my favorite. Thanks for watching. Peace.